Hey there, this is Jacob and today um, it's a special video. I'm gonna present to you my very first uh, wooden, all wooden color guitar. And uh, as you might have seen in uh, the last video, I've been talking about making this uh, wooden body, uh, this laminated body from this uh, very stunning uh, Botsai maple. And ever since I built these uh, hemp guitars, people uh, kind of ask me, uh, "What's what's the impact of the of the hemp body? What's the impact on the sound?" And uh, and it's, it's really hard to to try answer because uh, yeah, there are so many different um, uh, things that that influence the sound of a guitar, and um, the the back is just just one one piece of it. And I build my guitars in a kind of a way. At least like with the um, hemp stone, with the hemp bodies, uh, that it's quite, that the back is quite uh, passive. So, um, so the back here on these hemp stone guitars, you can still hear it work, but it's, it's mostly because uh, the top is vibrating too. And um, yeah, the, these, these backs, because they are like arched like that, and shape alone makes it that it's 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 quite quite stiff and quite quite um yeah it it moves a little bit like in the middle but but here it's it's like super stiff and yeah the main main reason i do this is um yeah it's like super comfy to play these um it's almost like an electric guitar and um, i got like this this uh curve out here and yeah it fits like, really nice and uh, yeah, that's that's kind of the, the, the main reason why I uh, use the hemp. And of course, um, something like this is, is really hard to do in like a yeah in a wood. <laughs> but um, yeah, I, I tried to I tried to uh, kind of simulate the same idea. So uh, the main thing is I got this this kind of uh, relief here. It's like on, on a Stratocaster, like on the back you've got, got this, this relief. And um, it's a similar idea. So it's, it's uh, narrow here and yeah, it fits, fits better to, to your body. And I have to say, um, it's a little bit more clumsy than the Hamstone guitar. So um, I think it, it helps a lot, like uh, giving a nice feel. But um, you really you you feel like this edge here and the edge down there, and it feels more bulk, bulk bulky than uh, the hemp hemp stone uh, version. But yeah, um, just wanted to uh, show you this um, first guitar I made, and uh, yeah, it's kind of the prototype and a lot of things. Um, yeah, I'm still working on. Uh, it's a little bit um, bigger than the uh, normal guitars, so it's basically the the size of the or uh, the thickness of the sides added on top. So yeah, as you can see, this this frame is quite quite thick, and um, yeah, I think that also uh, changes the sound a lot. Um, like uh, the, the mass and the thickness and the stiffness of the of the frame. Uh, I think it, it um, yeah, matters almost more than the back itself and yeah but keep this in mind and I will now play both uh, of the guitars so I've chosen um, this one right here to compare it to because um, all the wood like on the frame, on the neck, headstock, bridge uh, Board. <laughs> everything uh, it's like the, the same same maple it's literally from the same tree from the same board so uh, no difference there um, and I think it will be a good comparison and I will play two pieces uh, one in uh, standard tuning with a couple on the second fret and one in a open tuning
right, so there you have it. Um, I hope you could uh, hear some difference. And um, yeah, I hope you like these um, wooden versions also. And um, yeah, it's maybe an alternative to the to the handstone. Um, yeah, I don't know why, but uh, I think some people might be skeptical skeptical about the the hamstone. Uh, uh, there's really no reason, uh, but um, yeah, it's maybe an alternative. Uh, it's quite more, a lot more work and um, all of that, but I think yeah, looks quite quite stunning and. Uh, I'm making another one as we speak and yeah and we will see how that will turn out all right so uh, yeah thanks for watching uh, please let me know uh, how you like the guitars uh, which one you would prefer and yeah see you next time